A British auctioneer announced plans to auction off the very last letter written aboard the Titanic before the ship sank 102 years ago this month. But more important than the price tag is what the letter tells us about those who went down with the ship. We're all vaguely familiar with the story, and with the film version of the story. On April 10, 1912, the RMS Titanic set sail for New York from the United Kingdom. Four days into its maiden voyage, the ship hit an iceberg and sank in the Atlantic Ocean. According to the BBC, the letter being auctioned off was written just a few hours before the ship went down. This mighty expanse of water, no land in sight, and the ship rolling from side to side is being wonderful. The BBC report survivor Esther Hart wrote the letter to her mother in East London. Hart mentioned in the letter that she was sick the day before and that her seven-year-old daughter, Eva, sang so nicely at a church service that morning. According to the auctioneers, Eva also added a line of her own, heaps of love and kisses to all. More than 1,500 people died when the ship sank April 15th. Hart got the letter from her husband's coat pocket before she and her daughter were rescued. Her husband didn't make it. The letter was reportedly mentioned in Eva's biography, Shadow of the Titanic. The Daily Mirror reports she went on to become one of the most famous survivors of the Titanic disaster and was an outspoken critic of the White Star Line for not providing enough lifeboats. Hart died in 1996 at the age of 91. Auctioneer Henry Aldrich and son expect Esther Hart's letter to fetch up to 100,000 pounds or more than 160,000 U.S. dollars. The letter will be auctioned off with other Titanic memorabilia April 26th. For Newsy, I'm Christian Bryant.